this is not dead quiet. Hold up. Yeah, that's a bit better. So I just looked at um, Twitter, and uh, for CD for CDL, apparently attaches an unrestricted free agent for next year. What the hell? Why is Minnesota not bringing attach back? That doesn't make sense. Gravity is an unrestricted free agent. That's no surprise. Gra Pentagram as well. I, can't, I didn't think Crim6 is unrestricted. Polex is unrestricted. I know General and Pro Loot were. But damn. Alright. I don't know if I'll be able to find any games today. I say that and I just find a lobby for a 3v3. I've done it for it before. Alright. Put the phone aside. I'm gonna try to make the best of this stream. Because unfortunately my schedule keeps getting changed on me. Because this week, I had it all planned out in terms of streaming. I had it all planned out. Apex and Rainbow Six are supposed to be happening Thursday and Friday afternoons. Not in the afternoon birthdays. But then I got some shifts dropped in on a time I probably would have been streaming. So I made the decision to change them to night streams for Wednesday and Thursday. Because I know Friday night, I'm probably not going to be bothered with streaming. So... Now today, I was planning on maybe going for a couple of hours, because I know matchmaking would at least improve, to some degree. But... I've given a shift that is happening in three hours, so... To just... Yeah, so unfortunately I have to have a shorter stream today. Which sucks. I wanted to have a decent stream of BO3, but I can't. It sucks, but hey, what can I do? All I can do is make the best of the situation I'm given. Yeah, I actually haven't played BO3 in a bit, too. This is literally the first time I've touched BO3 in a... almost a month. And I played it a tiny bit while I was on holiday, just to see how it felt on the PS5. But I only played it the once, and I was like... The first day I had access to a PS5. Actually, no, it was the second... It was the first full day I, stayed, I was in one place. Ooh. He's got the beams. Alright, I see you. You've got the shot. I might be stupid here. Oh yeah, that honestly surprised me a little bit, I won't lie. I was fully expecting, like, here to get pushed. I was about to say, I'm not too far from my kinetic, I can maybe, oh, it's a good thing I did not go to pop it there. That would have been a waste. Dude, why is the XR2 so fucking good? Can I just ask? Why is the XR2 
so good. I thought I was always on and off of this gun. But that's why, since I've started playing BF3 this year, the XR2 has just felt godly. I don't know if it's... I'm not even running high cal. That's the thing, I'm not even running high caliber. So it's not like I'm getting fucking piss easy headshots with it. I don't know what's going on, this gun just... Like, legit, that's my build. It's literally just ELO quick draw stock. That's all I have in this fucking thing. Yeah, for some reason, it is incredibly good with headshots. Don't know why that's the case. See? Like, all I get is just headshots with this gun. Oh, I was trapped in a pinch there. I wanted to contest the guy behind me with the M8, so I assume he spawned behind me. And I just see the dude with the fucking dingo. Dude. Dude. The XR2, it's just different. I actually wish the XR2 was in zombies. I feel like it would have been a really interesting addition. But I know they probably would have had a harder time, you know, trying to make it unique from the M8. But they could have done the same thing they did with the M16 and Black Ops 1, actually. Just make it fully auto. That would have been interesting. You know. The XR2 would have been cool to have in zombies. Like, cause, yeah. So I know the M8 was supposed to be the new sort of M16, but, like. Dude, the XR2 is just fucking Battery. different. I'm... My god. Enemy down. I saw you there, boy. You ain't so sneaky there. Oh! Imagine if I burned him with the RK5. That would have been nasty. That could have been a clip. Oh shit, hi, where'd you come from? Popped up out of nowhere. But since I have, you know, brechies and stuff, I'm gonna have to be careful pushing into these, buddy. I saw you in there. Uh oh, there's a tempest behind her, it's not good. I'm dodging it. Ah, oh, no, I'm not. I'm not dodging anything. Oh, good thing I had kinetic there. Kinetic really like saved me, kept me up. Except for there, because I'm pretty sure he got a f Maybe he got a few- I think he, I feel like he headshotted me, but there's one bullet. Encounter UAV inbound. Friendly UAV inbound. Ugh. Quarter of a Tempest. Take that. Oh, dude. 
If you run in this door, it's not gonna go well for you. Get a UAV overhead now. Can we just do what the rest of the team? Oh, well, actually, no. Good point. Ah, oh, I choked. We're gonna do it as a hater. Holy shit. Okay. Not complaining. Oh, it's a teammate. I'll just fucking shot at. Oops. Ah, oh, I wasn't ready for that. How do I not read that well enough when I've got a hater? Look. Oh, I could have had something filth. Oh, I almost dropped 40 first game. Holy sh- What the fuck? Hmm. Okay. Just first game on. With an XR2. I swear. Just... I don't know why, but in my experience playing Black Ops 3 since it came out, on both PS3 and PS4, Metro is like, god tier to run the XR2 on. I don't know why, but it, for me, I, I don't know what it is. Just that combo just can't be beat. XR2, Metro. It's a recipe for disaster for the enemy team, if, if you, if you know. If you're good if you can hold your own don't try to work let me support my boy here we go combine all right I won't complain about combine give me that Anyone else announcing free agency? <laughs> I'm waiting. Okay, first played card, most recent card, best card, worst card. First played was Black Ops One. Most recent Vanguard. Best Black Ops Two. Worst. Is warfare. Uh. Oh, yeah, Razorback. Kind of forgot I had this. Oh. What was that? I just pulled. Too busy going on about Twitter and shit, and I pull that out of my ass. What the fuck? Oh, I'm trying to style and I'm already. That's a. I, I think that's probably a clip.
I also made a little bit of a discovery last night too. To my surprise, I was actually finding games on Vanguard at like 1 in the morning. And they're of decent ping as well. Some of them were like 200 ping, like what I normally tend to get with the matchmaking of Vanguard. But I was also getting some like really decent ping games. But it weirded me out. But at the same time, it makes me think I might try doing like late night Vanguard streams at some stage. Might try and start doing that every now and then. Because the thing is, I think because of my work schedule primarily. I'm gonna have to probably have some days where there's double streams or, you know. I'm gonna have to start doing that, I feel like. Because my work schedule's always... For the most part, it's always changing. Which... Is the, it's the annoying part about my job, like, you know. It directly impacts my streaming and stuff, like, you know. I've only just started recently posting schedules and stuff. Like, I've always had a schedule to myself, or what I plan on doing on what day, I just never announced it. But now that I'm starting to announce my plans, that way if people want to see me do a certain thing, they can try and pop up for that stream if the time suits them. You know, like, say... Apex, I know, like, some people pro would probably want to see me play Apex, especially because I haven't played it in a bit. Like, I wouldn't mind playing Apex again, but, like, I've had to move it to Wednesday night because of my changed schedule. Even though I had no intention of streaming tomorrow or Wednesday, for example, because of my original schedule. But I've just had f four... Well, fr well, free with an asterisk. The reason I say that is because one shift that I had moved was organized last week. Right. Then, yeah, like I like my job. It's easy. Like you know, it's something I'm used to doing because I know I can do well with it. Oh, that was unlucky. Oh, I've, okay. Now I'm starting to realize maybe that's why I was running like quick draw, fast mag, extended mag on a Razorback before, like, before I started playing this game again. Like when I was playing it a bit a couple years ago. I think I recall why now. Even though I'm, I love how the stock feels because I can just strafe people all fucking day. But I think now I remember why I was running what I did. What the fuck? Happened? Okay, what was that movement? That was something. God damn. I'm trying to be careful here because people with like shotties somewhere. And I haven't gotten a kill in a little bit too. I'm I'm getting smacked up a little. Need to start building a comeback. Ah I was shooting at the wrong spot. Nah, I did not put myself in a good position there. I might have to try it. I, I don't know if I've got extended mags unlocked right now though. Might have to try that again and see how it goes for me. It might prove better in gunfights, because I've had a few where I lost because I had to reload. I'm going to have to give it a chance again. Damn. Just positive. I was off to I was doing good too, but then I just started getting shat on a little bit. Oh, bro. Okay, that's a. You don't. I don't. I personally don't think you need rapid fire on a cruder, but whatever floats your boat. If that's what works for you, then so be it. Yeah, I might try that. Um. I 
I don't know, I'm losing my train of thought, holy fuck. Trying sandbags instead of stock. That way, um, I can I can stand a tiny bit more of a fight and sit. Because there's a few situations where I was like, fuck, now I'm starting to realize why I was running extended mags once upon a time. Now I'm remembering. Decent XP though, still, I'm not complaining. Uh, where is my Razorback? Here we go. No, I don't have it yet. Okay. Damn. Not far off it though. But I don't have it yet, so I can stick I can stick this. Um oh, I don't have any good cameras for it. Okay. So that's why I'm running underworld. Damn. Okay. Oh, uh, actually give me infection. I wanna do I have a Shiva? I'm gonna be silly. I'm gonna try a Shiva. I'm gonna give the Shiva a crack. I wonder how it'll go. Hmm. Pardon that. Shiva, 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 there you are. I wonder if my aim will be there. Let's find out. I knew I was going to get pushed. It's a matter of when. I think what's making it harder is it's literally. Well, I didn't leave the lobby, so that's on me, but. So I think it's literally like the same team. Like in terms of like who I'm playing against. I think it's literally the same team setups as the combine. That was... I was gonna say, there's no fucking way I'm getting away with that, like... Get out to here! Ah, uh, what? There's two of you up there now? Fucking hell. Everyone's in the church, apparently. I might have to change it up from Reshiva. I wanted to... I wanted to run it, but I guess it might not be... Might not work this match. Might have to try something else.
Yeah. So there's no way he didn't see me there. Clean kill. Team back, calm down, Jesus. Do I be glad I talked the brecci to the face and not you? Dick. I'm just gonna sit here and wait a sec. I'm waiting for him. Demo Demo KIA. Are they just gonna push here? Is that all they're gonna fucking do? Yep. Is it teammate behind you? Oh my god, I what did I just win this? Okay, good, that teammate got the kill. Holy, I was gonna say, if he did not get that kill, holy shit. Like, well, what am I seeing right now? That would have been embarrassing. Oh my god, I just got fucked? When did he whip out a dredge? Okay. I thought he was still using like this. Oh, he was using a sub of some sort. Holy fuck, that was... Yeah, he is. Okay. He just picked one up, I guess. Oh my god. I'm just getting fucking shit on. Look at this dude. I can't fucking gun him. Did you spawn there or did you flank? I'm assuming that was a flank because the spawns are still here. Wait. That's not right. Why'd I spawn here? Demo asset destroyed. Okay, I guess they didn't flip. That's... Okay. They probably should have flipped, but hey. Ah, oh, Bratchy. Fuck. Oh, yeah. So, what are the spawns in this game right now? They're a bit. Bit odd. Less from what I'm noticing. I wonder if I. I'm gonna try and find a different lobby. That looked like a little bit of lag. Oh, f Wow, more a lot is happening now. So hold on, let me just start from the fucking Alright. We're gonna give this a sec, cause let's, we're gonna talk a little bit about fucking Rostermania for COD. We're gonna talk a little bit about it. I'll check with you later. Yeah, fucking hell, I'm matching against dudes that are... Hold up. This dude. I'm curious about you. Can I see a record? Yes, I can. What are you? 
Like, fresh start. Fucking, okay, he's just reset a bunch. He's fucking good, too. He's better than me. What am I in? Yeah, fucking hell, he's definitely better than me by a while. Damn. He also reminded me a bit of a dude that I was running into the last time I was playing this a lot. Um, I can't remember his name, but he always ran Heatwave and he always had a VMP. He had like a fucking 4KD. It was fucked. But, anyway, back on track. So we're going to talk about Rostomania just a little bit. So, it kicked off with Boston releasing TJ Halley. So that I didn't pick up the... So that I had him on a 1 plus 1. So that I had him on a 1 year contract. Or a... 1 guaranteed year, 1 year they had a team option. And they didn't exercise the team option. So they've let him go into free agency. Which is interesting, because I honestly thought Boston might have wanted to run it back. Because unless they're doing this because they plan on keeping Vivid, and they might try and move Caps at all into a different role. Because they said, I remember them saying earlier in the year that Caps at all was a part of their long-term plans. When they benched him. So maybe... They're looking to move Capsidor back onto the roster and maybe have either him or Vivid, I imagine, move onto the flex for the following year, for the next COD. And I said earlier in the stream, Prolu in general have become free agents. They're no longer substitutes for Optic. Uh, Crim6 and Paul X are free agents. Paul is a restricted free agent, but Crim is unrestricted. So that's really interesting. Pentagram is an unrestricted free agent. And he was the sub for LA Thieves. So he was on a team that just had a ring. Um, what else has happened? Gravity, who was the main alpha Paris, is a free agent now. All of Minnesota are free agents. They're all unrestricted. So that's really interesting. Because I honestly thought they would have kept at least Attach and maybe... Maybe Priester, maybe Havoc. And also Bance is now an unrestricted free agent. So he's no longer on Toronto. I mean, he might st he might turn up in Toronto again, but for now, he's an unrestricted free agent. And I was talking to Andrasse about this not too long ago. Uh, we were speculating stuff about Toronto, because... We were saying, like, oh, like... Because we both heard Toronto are looking to make moves. And I'd said, like, it's either Cami or Bance. That's probably going to go, because Inside and Kleenex are most likely staying. And Bance is one of... Andraste's favourite players. So she was saying, like, don't... They better not get rid of Bance. Like, leave Bance alone. I was like, well, the only way I could see trying to make a roster change is maybe Bance is gone in some capacity, whether he retires or he becomes a free agent. And lo and behold, he's now in the free agency market. Um, I'll run the HEK on this one. So it's shaping up to be an interesting off-season already. It looks like today is, today is day one. Well, not exactly day one, but like a lot of contracts are up. Oh my god. So any CDL teams looking for a Black Ops 3 player, hit my line. <laughs> There's no way that's happening though, but hey. But man, this... 
The next card is going to be super interesting. And I, I don't know what I'm going to do yet. I don't know if I'm going to wait till it comes out. Or if I, well, I might not, I'm probably not going to pre-order it. I don't know. I'll probably just buy it on release day. I'll probably just buy a digital copy and then... Eventually, for the sake of collection, get a physical, maybe? I don't know. I thought you could slide under that! Or maybe you have to crawl. Maybe you can't crouch, but you can crawl. I don't know. So I'm pretty sure you can actually get under those... that the train when it's going. Somehow, but maybe I'm wrong about that. Oh, fuck! I thought a guy with a Tempest was in the middle there, where I was. Huh. Well, I'm wrong about that, obviously. No. Oh. I could have popped kinetic there, but I'm I'm glad I didn't. What was that dude trying to do there? My God, just give me the headshots. Had a little bit of a straight go on there. I could have had a lightning. I'm not sure how close I was though. I want to say I was one to keep. Oof. Ah shit. Wait, where the fuck? Where'd that come from? That one? Okay. So there's a sentry in the middle somewhere, that's good to know. Okay, so he's hanging around that side. Fast mags and rap. Okay. Why not? Pretty sure the metal was one of the slower ARs. I'm kind of surprised he hasn't got anything to buff that. No. Well. Simplicity wins sometimes. That's the sentry. That's why I'm not challenging it on that side. Oh, you're cheeky. Cheeky fucker. That's why he's control- Okay. I get it now. That's why he's controlling the side. Because he can control his sentry. Cheeky. I see what you're trying to do. He's not happy about that. He's not going to be happy about losing his tempers. Movement be diff. Okay. 
Oh. I was actually tempted to pop kinetic there as well. Maybe it wouldn't have been a bad idea to actually. I got stuck in that teammate, that's what happened. Okay, so he's on the way. I mean, this is pretty neck and neck so far. I thought I was talking there. We actually- what? We were up 98, 99, 97, we should have had a kill there. Fuck. Damn. They just clutched. Fuck. Oh my god. Just trying to type up a text real quick. There we go. Go oh, random, I wanna see what we can get. Now I'm just gonna keep scrolling through Twitter because like there's a lot of things happening. I'm really curious. Oh, I just wanna uh, Is there anything else? Town, fuck, okay. Time to whip out the VMP, see what I can get done. Ah, oh, fuck. Slid right into his view. Oh yeah, we're getting shit on already to start off. Uh, 
We're gonna get stuck in this spawn for a bit, I can already tell. It's already starting. Yeah. Because they're just gonna hide behind that truck, they're just gonna keep it covered. It's gonna be a hard time breaking through. Well, at least we've had a kinetic play. But. As if the ball can be rolling. Damn. There's always one person there that I'll look and shoot at, and then someone else is there, ready to clean up. Let's grab that kill. Fuck. This is not going too well so far. Sacred up arrived for a pick me up. Yeah, uh, I need a bit of a pick me up too. I'm getting fucked on. Look at this. This is a shit show. Merc is kicking my ass and pushing me down. Yeah, well, that's. That's kind of what I'm cop. Yeah, nah, I'm out. I can't stick that lobby. Yeah, it sucks to hear the wax kick wax kicking my ass a bit too. No, I'm just trying to. Ugh. I need. I wanna. No. Okay. Here we go. So this dude. I wanna suss me out. I love Housand. Oh, he's got like the same. Okay, same KD. I've been running an entire department on my own. Again? Again! I'm trying to say, every time I hear you talk about work, it sounds like you're always fucking doing that. You're always running a department on your own. Literally alone? Fucking hell, dude. That's... That's not fucking right. It really isn't. What was this one? Ah. Okay. Uh, I'll unlock Ripper 2. Oh, I don't know if I break yet. Two co workers had to leave because of family emergencies. Okay, well, if they had an emergency to attend to, fair enough. Like, that's fine for them to go. But the fact that, you know, you can't get help from the sounds of it, it's, it's a bit fucked. Like,. I just... There's no replacements either. Oh, dude. That's just... Ugh. Ah! Ads. One left at 7, so one day started. One left at 11. Far out. That's just rough. D Why is there a... There's a Dead by Day Out player playing Black Ops 3. What the fuck? TTV, you're toxic near. Why? <laughs> okay. And considering I'm running active camo, I, I don't know if an AR is going to be the right thing here, so I'm just going to. I'm actually going to try running a sub. So I'm fucked? Yeah, clearly. Oh shit. Yeah, I just got fucked too. I fucking heard someone behind me. I've been trying to keep up, but I can't. I feel like you'd... I don't know. I don't know what to really say. Because I know there's nothing you can do about it. Well, I want to say, fucking, try and sort something out with management, but from what I've heard, 
I don't want to be bashing your workplace, but it doesn't... It just doesn't sound like things are sorted. There's no... fucking functionality. We have no stock as well, so customers have been delightful. Ah, oh. You've got the Karen army today. From the sounds of it. Fucking hell. Actually, I'm gonna... I'm gonna tweak my VMP class after this game. I wanna try something. Normally I run this setup. But I haven't run stock on their VMP in a while. I used to change it up a fair bit. I think even at one point I had two VMP classes. One with long barrel and one with stock. Let's see how it goes with stock and see... Figure out what suits my playstyle a little bit more. I'm actually really curious. Cleaner kills. Yeah, no. Nah. I don't think it would have been right for me to pop kinetic. Not kinetic, fucking. Invis. Huh? I win that? Okay, sure. I don't know, what the fuck's going on? Whoa! Glitch? Nope, someone's invisible. Fuck's sake. Really? Really? You turned invisible! You fucking little bitch. Oh, that's sad, dude. Literally because I gunned him like twice. Because he's using an Olympia. And he goes invis? Dude, that's just. That's just sad. I don't get how you could let yourself do that sort of shit, dude. Like, it doesn't matter if it's a game where you know you can't get punished. It doesn't fucking matter. It's just. Straight up. Just not on. It's not fucking cool. So that's the worst part, you literally can't do anything about it. Oh, you're behind me? Dude, have you seen the free agents for COD? I was talking about that before, actually. Like, just before. At least now you're here, I can actually talk about it a little bit again. Much to... Yeah. I find it... Okay, so, going off top, so, the first move of this was TJ Halley, his team option wasn't exercised by Boston. And my suspicion with that is, is that they're bringing Capsital back into the lineup. Bance, I'm sad. I, I told you something would happen to Bance. Andras, I did not say if Tony were making a change, Bance is probably the most likely to go. Didn't I tell you? Well, I'm not trying to rub it in, like, I'm just saying, like, I, I fucking called it. Ready for deployment. That if anything was gonna happen to Toronto, Bance is probably on the chop block. I know you jinxed it. Yeah, well... He's... okay. I don't know what specialist he was running before, but that's the first I knew of him having a fucking purifier. But yeah, going back. 
So I think Bant's becoming a free agent. It doesn't mean he's guaranteed gone from Toronto. I'll just say that. It's not a guarantee that he's gone from Toronto. It's just that they haven't picked up his contract. He could go back on a new one. Good calling a hater as soon as I fucking... Yeah, I keep getting fucking sidetracked. So TJ's not getting his team option exercise, so he was on a 1 plus 1. With Boston, I assume all the players are on a 1 plus 1. Of all had a team option. Which is where... You know. It got exercised for, I assume, everybody else. I'll take that kill. That was a super risky kill I just grabbed too. Super risky. That wasn't too good. That judge from his tweet said Toronto's been fun, UFA. Yeah. So, from Bance's point of view, his future is uncertain. That's what that tweet comes off as to me. He doesn't know what's happening with his future. Like, he doesn't know if he's coming back to Toronto or not. He's probably assuming his time there is done. So, what I assume... I think the most likely team to pick him up... Is London. I reckon London or a team that wants an IGL that runs a sub. I think Bance is an IGL. I saw a comment saying Bance. That's that's what he does. I could be wrong. I could be just listening and looking at the wrong things for information. You would glitch, you bitch. Ah, oh, this dude. Disappointed. Fucking disappointed. General probably have gone for Yeah. Alright, let me go through the list. Let me go through the list. So, TJ did not have his team option exercise, so he's a free agent. So Boston could have brought him back, but they chose not to. Reason I assume is that they want to implement Caps at all back into the lineup. Because I reckon they're gonna keep Nero vivid in methods. General and Proly are no longer under optic as subs, so they're free to walk. Proly's probably gonna get picked up by like gorillas or something, I reckon. Gorillas or subliners. Depending, because he he's a flex. So a team that needs a strong flex, they'll pick him up. I'm pretty sure he was already under the Gorillas, if I'm not mistaken. Um, all of Minnesota are unrestricted free agents. They've all walked. They're gone. All of them honestly thought... Attach and maybe Priester or Standy... Would have fucking... Would have stayed... Okay, what I'm actually going to do, I'm just going to block this kid. Hold on. Um, this dude plays Sage as well, and he cheats in Black Ops 3, but he plays Sage. Because his fucking icon, his banner on PlayStation, is him in a 5 stack on Sage in a tournament. Or at least doing ranked. Sad. Here you are. But that's just my input. Nope. I'm not playing a lobby with that kid. You can fuck off. Okay, I'm giving it a minute so I can talk about this stuff. <laughs> so, all of Minnesota are free agents. And then the late Gravity, also from Paris. He's an unrestricted free agent. I assume this will probably go for the rest of that Legion squad, except for maybe Temp. Even though, supposedly, Temp has said he's probably going to be staying. Like, he's probably gonna be in Vegas next year. But. Yeah, just what I assume is. Yeah. So far, 
that's all that's really happened. There's probably going to be more that happens today. Within the next couple of hours. Ah, oh, okay, here we go. So the Chief Operating Officer actually just said something about... Minnesota about half an hour ago. A little bit more. Like, explaining... Explaining what's going on with, um... Minnesota. Uh, I'm just going to read the tweet word for word. So, Rocker Rostermania update. Attach, Sandy, and Presto will be unrestricted free agents when their contracts expire on the 22nd of August at 11.59pm. And the org will not exercise the option on Havoc's contract. We're talking with them about the possibility of re-signing as we evaluate all options. Fame remains under contract through the end of the upcoming MW Modern Warfare 2 season. So, basically what this guy is saying is that although <laughs> although all of Minnesota are unrestricted, he might, they might still end up playing for Minnesota. And now I've got the dude on my fucking team. I don't want to play with this dude. I don't want to. Trash. Doesn't I don't like honestly couldn't care if it's an older cod. Show it the respect it fucking deserves. I mean obviously nothing's gonna be done about these hackers. Like Triarch aren't gonna come back to Black Ops 3 and be like, ah, oh, this game's infested. Let's update shit and fucking get rid of it. They're not gonna do it. So they're too busy making their own cod as well as trying to keep Vanguard zombies and ranked player alive. Because Sledgehammer's folks primarily on the multi. Black Ops, you're clear to win. I'm just fucking gunning me. I don't know where anyone is, I'm just running around. It sounds like someone's ready. Yep. Artillery destroyed. I don't know, but I don't know I'm here. Till that now. The trigger is a blade. I fucked up there because I had to reload. But. Oh really? You're camping the f oh, I should have looked. Fuck's sake, I fucked myself up there. That's honestly pretty annoying. Neutralized. What the fuck? Why am I getting a shift from you? Oh. I have an hour break, right? I gotta go back to check on my co worker. Oh, yay, lovely. Ah, oh, fuck, I actually ran out of ammo. I don't want to be in this game because of the fucking dirt I've got on my team, but... Annoyingly, I don't have a choice right now. It's the only game I can find. 
I feel like this dude's probably turned on the fucking, you know, invis god mode shit too. I've got a funny feeling he has. He has. He's right in front of me, he's invisible. If you want to be invis, just run active camo, you fuckwit. Honestly. Look, I don't condone this shit in the fucking slightest. I'd rather the whole enemy team just leave the game, just fucking forfeit. Just do that. Well, game's over anyway. Oh, God. Just hate to see it. Okay, good, they left the lobby thing. Fuck. Actually, that's one thing I might try doing. I might actually save... I might actually try playing... running Glitch. I didn't really use it much at all. In the past. I really didn't. I might actually try and give it a go and see if I could... Okay, they're not playing together now. Cool. Good. I'm not so happy about that. Oh fuck. I don't know why I had a feeling that would happen. As soon as I saw the blip, I was like, I've got a feeling I'm gonna fuck this up big time somehow. Lo and behold, I do that. Especially with the M8 in hand. Where are they? Can we have some fucking kills please? Holy shit. Oh, fuck you. Okay, cool. Nice. So that's how it's fucking going down, is it? Ah, oh, you fucker. Sitting on the head glitch of a pacekeeper. Why is that every person I look at just fucking dies? Whether it's... Ugh. Why 
Fuck, I want a chance to do shit. I'm just trying to have a decent time before fucking I have to go to work. Just gonna remember we glitched, don't you? Did he just fucking fall off the map? Yes, he did. Nah, I fucked that up. It's not as smooth as. Fucking traces very cool. Dude. I'm just getting fucking beamed right now. Maybe the M8 isn't a play. I want it to be the play because I want to use it, but maybe it just isn't it. a bad feeling about the area. Might be right there. Hold up. I was gonna say, what was that I just heard behind me? Ah! Ah, I was fucked there anyway, actually. Never know, look at that spot. There's literally. I don't think there's any way I could get out of that. I don't know why I picked up that second M8. I don't need it. Probably would have been better off with the RK5. Oh, never mind. Separate ammo. Cool. Oh. Oh fuck. Back from Alpha Mike. Welcome back. Oh, that's it. That's that's a rip. So, huh? But, oh, okay. <laughs> and just, you know, it's funny. 
I literally just opened that fucking tweet that you just sent in the chat. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention fucking the New York ones. Shit. Yeah, so Crim's unrestricted. Okay, so Crim 6 is unrestricted. Well, I guess it's... Actually, now that I'm looking at the toy, it's specified if they're a restricted free agent. So, the free agent market looks like this right now. So, TJ, Crim, all of Minnesota, Bates, Gravity... Pentagram, Perlu in general. And Polex is a restricted free agent. It is. Fuck, okay. Uh, probably back to kinetic then. What's the difference between free agent and RFA? So, restricted free agent. Uh, so, hold on. So, unrestricted is just straight up, you know, they're free. They're not on a contract at all. Like, they're just in the market. Any team can sign them. They don't have to do anything else. They can just be like, oh, yeah, we want you. Come here. They don't have to do anything else. Whereas restricted, so New York are letting... So what subliners are doing, they're letting Paul X assess his options. Because if a team approaches Paul X, it'll be like, here's an offer we have for you. N New York can do one of two things. Either they can match... They can match that offer. So let's say Florida puts out an offer to Paul X, right? Let's say they're like, oh, we'll give you 60k to play with us for this season. New York can either let him go, or they can match that offer and keep him. I think that's how it works. But I'm still a little bit hazy on, you know, the terms like, oh, restricted free agent, unrestricted, all that sort of shit. It's still stuff I'm kind of learning, because of, like, basketball and stuff. I don't... It's, I still don't really get what it all means. Because I'm in a bit of a learning process with it myself, holy fuck. So, yeah, I assume that's what it means, sort of thing. I'm not 100% sure, you might have to look into it to see if I was close or not. Because I can't tell you for certain that that's... Like, what I was saying is 100% correct. Ah, fuck! No oh, electives, love. He must have found a squad to do a tournament with. I thought that computer was a person then for a sec. Dude, I'm actually not too bad with the Pharaoh. I'm not too bad with this fucking thing. Ain't too shabby. So let's see, let me just uh... I thought I was fucking up that kill there. Nope. Ah oh, shit, I just wasted kinetics, so I didn't realize he had a melee. I thought he had a fucking shotgun out, I thought I would have survived. Whoops. That was a bit of a goof. Spotted. I'm just gonna go through this one. No one else has come through this way. They're all going through the fucking building.
I just realized that's last my finger. How did you not realize that sooner? Go take care of your finger now. Oops, I've been too busy to notice. Well, go sort out your finger. Go sort out your fingy. I'm gonna need a new gun soon. I'm running out of... I don't know what this VMP setup is, but I'm gonna have to use it. Never mind. I won't have to use it. It's fine, it's not bleeding anymore. It doesn't matter. Attend to it. Put some disinfectant on it. Put on a band-aid. I don't give a shit if it's not bleeding anymore. Take care of it. This is why I shouldn't have people running departments on their own. In case of injury. Fuck you. You choked like twice to kill me, bud. Avez, what is this? Shiver, Mandraste. I don't want to have to tell you again. Sort out your fingy. Sort out your fingy, or else. You need to be careful, you need to take care of yourself. You can't just brush it off and be like, Oh, it's fine, I'll just cut it off, it won't be an issue. Can't do that. Hey, the fuck. Or else what? I don't know, I'll just, you know, not stream. Or just leave elation, fucking, you know. And it will be your fault. If it's cut off, there is an issue. Well, there will be an issue. D yeah. I give up. Just go sort out your finger, goddammit. Actually, no, I know. Andreas Day, if you don't go sort out your finger, finger, I will force you to 1v1 me on Black Ops 3. How about that? Sort your finger, or you are forced to 1v1 me in Black Ops 3. Infantry neutralized. Ah, you were a tempest. Okay, accepted. So, are you gonna go sort out your finger, or are you actually being a. or actually accepting a. What? Dude, that's twice now! Are you fucking serious? Or melee only? Oh my god. <sighs> Just sort your fucking finger out, please. Well, just sort yourself out. Because knowing you and Just, that you don't take care of yourself. Go fucking take care of yourself. I'll be pissed off if you don't. Do I accept it? Oh my god, I trust you. Oh my god. I know you're trying to shit stir me, but I'm actually concerned for you, so fucking don't. Sort your finger out. No, come on. You're injured, have some common sense. Take care of your fucking injury. 
No mad vent. Don't fucking listen to me. <laughs> ah. I'm trying to tell you to do the right thing, but you're not listening to me, man. So of course I'm going to get annoyed. So go take care of your fucking finger. Oh yeah, go. So your finger. I'm only going to be alive for another half an hour anyway. Probably not even that. Not gonna be alive for much longer because I'll have to start getting ready for work really soon. Only way this ends is with you in a body bag. Not where it is, I can't put a band-aid on it. Well, just do something. Just dis at least disinfect it and just make sure you don't fucking... Just prevent it from getting infected. Disinfecting it? Good. You need to take care of yourself with this sort of stuff, man. You can't just be like, eh, she'll be right, and, you know, you've got like a fucking broken finger or something. You can't do that. You just can't. That's not how this works. I might as well start disabling fucking... Notifications... It hurts? Yeah, well... That's the disinfectant killing the bacteria, man. It's not that bad. I mean, depend. Oh, it depends on... Uh, I don't know. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. <sighs> okay, so... Good if... Actually... I'm not even far for cameras on this thing, but I'm not gunning for cameras, I'm just playing. But yeah, unfortunately, because of what's going on at work, I can't, um, I can't stream this for ages. Which really sucks. Let's make this quick. Step one. There's not much I can do about it, though, unfortunately. Step two. Stirring you is too much fun, I swear to God. Yeah, you especially love doing it on stream when you know I can't respond as well. Because I have a hard time reading tone because it's fucking text. It's not voice. So I can't clap back. Whereas through this, where you can hear my voice and gauge my actual fucking reaction, you're sitting there on your phone at work being like, ha ha ha! Drives me insane. That's what makes it fun, yeah. You... Mm. I'm gonna get absolutely nothing out of this. A fast bags variant, seriously? Seriously? That's what I get? That's what I fucking get? Oh. Actually, hold on. I'm gonna check something in Zombie Energy real quick. When it, uh, you know, wants to load. There we go. Uh, I don't have an unlock, do I? Nah. Fuck. Well, I can't even look at it. I can't even see how it looks. Actually, yes, I can. What am I doing? Hold up. Wait on. Bye, folks. Why have I got a pair of six class? Okay, I don't know what I was doing there, but sure. Or was I looking at something? I've got no clue. 
So SVG fast mags. Oh, that's it. It's just a, it just becomes a ball instead of. I don't know how I feel about. I mean, it makes it kind of makes sense, but at the same time, I prefer how the ring looks because the how the rest of the gun looks. Not the biggest fan of that variant. See, that looks way better. But anyway, I'm probably gonna wrap it up here. You know, honestly, just that way I've got a little bit of time to relax and get everything sorted. Um, but yeah, I was actually planning on doing this over the weekend. No, I think I was I was supposed to do Black Ops Three fucking yesterday. I was supposed to do this yesterday, but because last night I ended up copying Ice Train, ended up dealing with that. And then for a little bit as well, I was feeling a bit sick in the gut. Fortunately, both things, I'm not dealing with either of those things right now. Like, the feeling in my gut was literally just... It was literally just my body telling me I needed to go to the toilet. Just not telling me in the greatest of ways. Instead, just be like, oh, you gotta go. It was like, oh, you're gonna feel like shit until you until you're like, alright, I've... I don't know what to do, I'm just going to sit for a minute, you know. And then the eye strain, that was really weird how that happened. But I was literally sitting here watching my friend Callie, watching her stream. Like, not Mori Calliope, but Callie's son. I don't know. She technically did a debut last night. But she did a Splatoon 2 stream. And I was sitting there vibing in her chat. And all of a sudden, I got like this really bad floaty in my. I noticed it was mainly in my right eye, because what happened was, you know, instead of a normal floaty where it's like it's like a line or something, like it's some sort of shape and it has an outline to it, it was more like static. It was more like I was looking at static, like just a tiny little dot, but it was in like the center of my sight. So I was trying to like read stuff in chat, like she. For example, Kelly put all her emotes in, just showcasing them, and whatever. And I was trying to peek at like the commands and stuff to pull them up, but I couldn't really read them properly, even with the blue light glasses I had on. And then it's it tr it ended up going down to like the bottom of my eye, which is really weird. Like I could see properly again, but like the like the bottom of my eye was just weird. Like it was I don't really know how to explain it. And then all of a sudden eye strain in the left eye. Fortunately it didn't bother me much for the rest of the night because I just ended up taking some Panadol and having some water and just rested a bit. Like I laid down for probably almost an hour. And then, yeah, it wore off. Fortunately. And. Yeah, so I'm not dealing with either of those things now. So, this was supposed to happen yesterday, but. It just didn't end up that way, unfortunately. But hopefully, I can. Figure everything out. This week, hopefully. Hopefully, after this week, work will be a bit easier to you know, work around with, because sometimes it does enjoy being rather tricky. Anyway, and, and I'd rather say, as much as I would do one more, I'd rather end the stream now than end it on potentially a shit note, in case I run into like a hacker or something again. I don't want to... I don't really want to risk that, to be quite honest. So, for now, I'm just going to leave it. Even though I didn't level... I only leveled up the once. But hey. It's... It's whatever. It's not much I can really. Do about it. No, that's just awesome. 
Ja. I thought almost a week of playtime into Black Ops 3 multiplayer. Holy shit. I'm so close to this, though. Prestige Master. I'm close. 14 levels off. So you bet your ass, I'm gonna be pl I'm gonna start playing this again. I'm probably gonna be playing it off stream as well. I'm probably gonna be bouncing between this Vanguard, Overwatch, and maybe a little bit of Genshin, and Dead by Daylight. I got a lot of things to play off stream, man. Holy fuck! <laughs> I have a lot. Then again, I did a checklist on the eighth. No, on the seventh, like last Sunday. Of things I have to catch up on and how much time I have left. Vanguard, I've got like nine days now to climb like 70 ish levels, which I can do. Especially if I try and play games late at night, because I was actually finding some games, which was weird. So, anyway, I might actually try and pull up a late night Vanguard stream at some stage and see how that goes. Even though I know last time I was, while streaming Vanguard, I was saying I'm probably not going to stream it again for a bit just because. I'm mainly going to play the zombies, no one wants to watch the zombies, yada 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 yada. Anyway, I'm going to stop stalling now. And I'm going to go and just get myself sorted for the day of work I have waiting for me. So anyway, shall leave it all here. Um, yeah, Wednesday night I'm going to try and give Apex a go. And Thursday night, I'm going to try and play Siege for the first time in, like, two or so years. It's been a long time. Last time I played it was... It was before Cold War came out, actually, when I played it. So I remember it was on my original PS4. I remember one of the last games I played, I got a 3K of a Nitro Cell, and I recorded it. I don't have that footage anymore, and I'm so fucking sad. I hope one day I can repeat that. Anyway. I should get this all sorted. I will hopefully catch you on the next stream. If not, hopefully I'll see you again at some stage this week. Anywho, peace out.